Yes. Yes, Sandy. Yes, sir. Where shall I start? Uh, yes, you may. You have two minutes. We want to do it quickly. Okay, sir. Three adults are having a discussion about developing our village. Vijay, right? Uh, our country is entering a new era of development. We must keep up with the times. Sanju, auntie? I agree. Even our children think our village is too ruler. Too ruler. Let us brainstorm some ideas. I have an idea that will help our village have has never had a public tap. Let's just install a uh, Dunge Dara for public uses. Our village must be illuminated at night. I suggest installing street lights by the roads. There is no proper place for us to hold events or just gather. We must build something like a Chautara. Uh, these good ideas which the villagers came up with help them to detect problems around the village and help them become aware. So as we can see here, once the villagers became aware, it will be easier for the government to develop in a wider range. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, thank you so much. Thank you so much. So that was a very short skit uh, where they uh, showed the local people's uh, participation, which would uh, ultimately help the government because they get the support when uh, local people are when local <clears throat> people are uh, like uh, participating. Then there is sense of ownership. The uh, the people uh, not, um, the people. Uh, Feel it's theirs and they protect it and that's how like development can sustain if the people uh, feel it's not theirs then what happens they don't feel it's there and they might not uh, so interest towards the project or they might not so interest towards the development activity uh, that's why local people's participation is very necessary like they might keep on uh, creating a obstacle they might uh, keep on creating obstacle because they are not involved in the in the decision making process to everything so that's how like uh, local people's participation is uh, very important. Okay, so that is very short kit and we don't need to go so much in detail about the uh, uh, people's participation. There was a question in page number 10 and uh, previous uh, curriculum. This was one of the lesson as well. And right now it has been just kept in one of the part of uh, lesson one. So that's why we just went through it. So is there any uh, difficulty in understanding why is the need of people's participation important now? Any confusion? No, right? We don't uh, want to go so much in uh, detail for that topic only. Okay, so uh, next activity. Uh, if you're using the Nearpod, uh, you can be uh, using with one. Most of you are using the Nearpod. Uh, I will be uh, voting out itself from that if it works out well for you, okay? However, like I will uh, be sharing the sc screen for now. So that was a search kit. So other groups will get uh, afterwards. <clears throat> okay, now this. Uh, before we uh, move on to the activity, let me just uh, quickly talk about the is and does of like <clears throat> the assignment itself very quickly. Okay. Uh, based on how many of them I have done, how many of them I have not done. I know it's already there. You also know. I also know. But it's just a reminder. Okay. Uh, for some of you, if you have forgotten only. Very uh, quickly. So here in classwork, if I go here, uh, since it's social studies class, uh, let me just check out of social studies. People's participation in development. Twelve still uh, not done. Eleven turning. So please try to meet up the deadline. Like if it's continuous, uh, like the record, like I see it's not been done, then we'll have to talk individually about these things. Okay. Like 12, before this, like all of them are, have been already checked. Nine, uh, four return, 10 turning. Once you see there is return means these things are also already checked. Like most of the cases, what happens is, like I check all the assignments and I return only the ones which I feel is acceptable at the time. Because few of them, there, there might be some uh, st uh, things they need to do correction on. Okay, that's why uh, it has not been already uh, returned back. So if you make changes in that uh, on time, then you get almost like 
full trades. If you don't make change and if you just leave it, then the grading goes down because you have not done the correction. Once you uh, do the correction, then almost you get uh, as good as like others. Okay, so try to just uh, do the correction on time. And here, also let me just uh, show this. So presentation for uh, next day only is uh, five uh, students could see, others cannot see that. Okay. And uh, based on uh, reflection, what you learned from the first lesson is the final to wrap up with that lesson. Okay, here 12 assign who have not given. Agrima, Dibzal, Geet, Karna, Kusan, Malika, Naman, Nirvik, Prasanna, Prasiddha, Suvi, and Bhaivavi. So if uh, there is any confusion, please uh, let me know. Is there any confusion in that assignment? Okay, if there is, uh, I don't think there is going to be confusion because of, I gave you the worksheet itself, uh, which uh, would answer um, the question. What is the advantage of people's participation? The worksheet itself exactly is written there. Only if you just write it in your own words, that's enough. Maybe uh, writing itself won't uh, help you, but if you don't still understand what is written there, then you can ask me. But to do the assignment, it's so easy. Answer is directly in the worksheet. Just writing that in your uh, own words is uh, not so tough. Okay. Uh, so, uh, that was the one and now finally uh, reflection there's a reflection sheet over here uh, you can do this reflection sheet on your own time uh, it's a reflection at the end of the lesson earlier i gave you in the d1 itself uh, since reflection is important so you can do that in your own time later on that's based on uh, lesson one we don't want to take too much of the class time uh, itself Okay, uh, or does it become too much assignment when I give it for assignment only? Like everything for assignment, class time. Uh, more or less, I want to make sure that we do in the class something that you really need a teacher with. If there's an a any activity you don't need a teacher, that can be kept as an assignment. So that later on it doesn't uh, become very difficult for us to like if they, uh, we have to complete the course also. We don't want to hurry too much quickly at the last hour also. Instead, like the assignment can be reduced if there is too much uh, work from this subject only. Okay, so now uh, let's move on with the uh, topic. You can see in the uh, near part also, there's an activity. From among that, you can if you're not using a near, a near part at all, if there's a technical problem, I am uh, presenting for today uh, in my screen also, but try to use the uh, near part when I told so it will be easier in the future for me so that I can exactly know we're using the near part and I can exactly interact through that uh, itself. Okay. Okay, please uh, look at the near part. Can you all see the near part? Okay, please see that activity and uh, you can do it in the uh, copy for now. Uh, you have five minutes for that maximum five minutes it becomes easier for me to uh, see your everyone's uh, face when it's uh, near pod as well at times please turn on your video You don't have to do all of them. Just uh, pick up one of them and just draw it how was then and now, which you are already used to. Okay, just draw a picture. Uh, yes, draw it in your copy. And later on, you'll have to take a photo and send it uh, in the Google uh, Classroom itself when I keep it in the assignment place. There will be a place for you to send. Clicking and sending, which you are already used to. Whatever classwork is done, there will be a place to... Take a photo and send it. Photo of uh, yeah, whatever you have done in the copy. Because it's quite difficult for you to be drawing in the computer itself and it takes much time. 
and the class is uh, goes than the concept yes okay uh malika i it's sound is coming quite small right now yeah can you repeat once again hey, okay okay i'll send that near pod often because i cannot exactly see at times who is doing uh what like if some of them are lost or anything Uh, once you're uh, done, you can just show it in the screen it itself, okay? Like how much you have done, I need to see, right? Uh, not now, I'll ask after some time. Before we uh, move, just to see how much you have finished. Once you have finished, please uh, raise your virtual hand. Can you hear me? Okay. Yes, because I don't, because yes, at times sir. I don't know if like YouTube while it's been played, if my sound goes or not, okay, at times, that's why. Once you are uh, done, please raise your virtual hand. Okay, so I get idea how much I've been finished. All the time is just ma maximum five minutes. Okay. You don't have to make so uh, so perfect picture in this. Okay, just for you to understand the concept of then and now. You have been seeing photographs, everything. Yes, Sanvi. Sir, 
sir, like, do we all, first we write in the table, then after that we take one topic, then draw the picture? No, no, you can just draw one picture only because we have done similar type of activity in last class, writing, isn't it? Uh, so think from those perspective and just draw. Okay, just one of them is enough. If you can include all of them in one picture also, it's fine. But time limit is five minutes, okay? Then and now. Just to see your concept. Not fine art. It's not based on fine art, okay? It's just to see the concept. Time is there. Work it out about it, grammatical, th the, there are drawing any one of them, I had uh, written it. Uh, draw, yeah, draw any one of them out of them, okay? Or you can try to include all of them in then or in now also. Okay, one minute left. Well, it will go whole time, so we uh, let's wrap up in one minute now. So, do we have to draw all five of them? Uh, no, you don't have to be drawing all of them. Uh, draw how much you can. Uh, I, I at least uh, one of them, if possible. Just one picture then and now. So I'm uh, just trying to say you think from this perspective. Okay. Maybe it will be better uh, to understand from this perspective as well for now because I have to now um, uh, incline it more to social studies as well. So trying to connect things with uh, more with the subject than other things in general. So you are on mute. Mm, sorry about that. Can you uh, all show exactly what picture you have uh, made from the camera itself? Very clearly, just uh, nearby, so if you can, everyone can just see each other's uh, very quickly as well. It's 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 fine. Like it's just to see the concept that uh, you have made. Yeah. Riha has uh, just shown her just once. Others, please, uh, let's show it quickly. Let's show it quickly. It doesn't have to be so fine art. Okay, now let's stop with that and you will, uh, uh, you can post that later on. I will keep the link. Uh, now let's go to the next uh, so this is just one activity uh, so that you are still uh, remembering about the concept of uh, development so it's all about uh, positive change and progressive change so that there is better human uh, standard of human uh, life so there has to be like development has to be in terms of social economical political physical demographic environmental different factors so that's why i chose a few of uh, the things over here so that based on all this if there's a positive change if it's better than before if there's a progress going on continuously then that is uh, 
that is development. And we discuss also about uh, utilizing various uh, resources such as uh, natural resources, human resources, and uh, final uh, sale resources for uh, development as well. So from uh, economical uh, aspect, natural resources and financial resources are important. From social, uh, we are going to study about all social uh, issues, social problems, which uh, needs like uh, eradication or elevation or anything. And uh, so that's what is about uh, development. It covers various areas. We okay? not just on only these areas uh, in the town only. It's covers in the rural areas, village areas. So wherever, if it's a uh, development in the rural, like we study rural development, urban development, okay, various uh, are you looking at the uh, near part? Okay, I'll, I'll be presenting here as well then for now. We don't want to, okay. So that's so that's uh, regarding the development things. So why do we need development? So this that's uh, okay. Why do we need this development? Why do we think? You can write that down in the chat box. Why do we think we need development? We have already been discussing. You can just write at least three points or two uh, that you think is or two one point at, at least is enough why do you think we need development you already got the concept of development let's write it down Uh, let us stop uh, doing that uh, drawing if you're uh, still continuing that please uh, stop it we'll get lost and you'll not understand okay you can do that later on and uh, submit right now i'm not asking for submission we cannot take whole class drawing it's not fine art class for us we're just trying to integrate all this uh, drawing to everything and if we keep on doing fine art there then it goes like an art class okay to sustain comfortable life, to take country to a developing state. Yes, uh, like we already know the definition of uh, development. We know uh, what is development. We understand what is the concept of development. Means if there is a change better than before, then what can uh, we can have comfortable life. We can have quality of life. It makes human life easy when there are uh, various positive changes in the society. Positive uh, in a sense, like if there's any uh, development in terms of like let's say health this uh, then there's going to be better health means once people have better health that's one of an indicator of quality of life itself okay like if, if there is development in uh, health like life expectancy increases so people can live uh, longer also and they don't have to die untimely when there's better health when there's better ch uh, change uh, same in case of uh, education also if education is uh, better uh, then there's going to be uh, be a better uh, future for most of the uh, student uh, student in the future like let's say after 15 years the, uh, whatever they go in the market that's going to be uh, like better in case of uh, education as well and so the country will also develop because they know how to work smartly because they're already uh, like into that system what is the best practices uh, to follow according to the time like working smartly in terms of uh, 
uh, bringing development in various sector like technical one of the thing is change in technology is very important factor of development most of the people are already uh, technical and they know how to make things uh, faster like i tried my best to make sure i don't take one period taking attendance of uh, four classes a day that's why i try to check out with the other extensions uh, hopefully it works okay because i don't want to take my whole time taking the attendance uh, uh, rather than teaching only okay and so that's uh, why we need uh, development and uh, when we have uh, development then there's fulfillment of various uh, needs of the people because one of the uh, definition of development we told is development is uh, because of happiness it's not because of just economic there is development people have to be happy okay just because the countries are progressing gulf countries the middle east countries uh, i have economic uh, growth better they have like uh, per capita income is high but they are not told to be developed like us the reason is because they are lagging behind in social development and that's why they are not uh, told as developed countries then when we say the when the when the term develop has been used it's not just looking at the economy and once the country is developed uh we have people like we don't have to depend on other countries like right now nepal has to keep on depending uh i'm not saying nepal is uh, totally uh, poor so far they, they have been keeping in, in uh, developing countries and we are get, been getting fund in the name of developing country once we are uh, out of developing country then the fund doesn't come so far the fund only comes from abroad when they say it's a developing country and one of the reason they are trying to say is because maybe the government still gets fund and they are not taking it out of the developing country which is not verified but okay so it's just a thing but we don't know exactly if it's out or not of developing country state some of them don't keep it out because they still get a fund if the country is developed then they don't come to, uh, giving fund to ingos and use for the development so development is very important for economic and social transformation so that's why i told not just economy even social aspect has to be also uh, seen like in case of like uh, social development we have people's like belief superstitions to everything like from tra traditional thought they start uh, coming with the latest uh, like contemporary uh, related thoughts so that's why we need development so that's it uh, for today uh, let me take a final uh, attendance uh, manually as well um, because sir, like, me, yes sir. yes sanvi sir viva didn't join the class today because of our internet connection yes okay uh, you, we can talk that in uh, viber afterwards also okay because i'm already late uh, i feel really like bad to take on another teacher's class okay okay thank you class and i have a class uh, as well in next class okay sir thank you sir bye sir bye sir yeah thank you